Hi, I am Kumitra Nagar and I would like to take a brief moment to introduce you to the PowerShell module for VMware Cloud Foundation Certificate Management. Today, the SDDC manager does not manage certificates for ESXi hosts. Instead, the VMware Certificate Authority on the vCenter server provisions each new ESXi host with a signed certificate where VMCA is the root certificate authority by default. To comply with the policy of your organization, you manually replace the host certificate. To simplify this process, we have created the PowerShell module for certificate management to give users the ability to manage ASXi host certificates across your VMware Cloud Foundation instance. This is an open source module which is hosted on GitHub and can be directly downloaded from PowerShell Gallery. To get started with certificate management, you can go to the GitHub page and follow the instructions for installing the module. The certificate management PowerShell module provides the ability to perform the following operations. Set the ASXi certificate mode in vCenter. Request certificate signing request. Verify the certificate authority is trusted in vCenter server. Set the lockdown mode for ESXi host. Get the vSAN summary from vCenter server for a cluster and install a certificate. You can refer to the GitHub documentation for all available commandlets, their description and examples on how to run them. To set the ESXi certificate mode in vCenter, open up a PowerShell console, replace the values in the sample code with the values of your VMware Cloud Foundation instance, and then run the command in the PowerShell console. The request ESXi CSR commandlet will generate the certificate signing request for the ESXi host and save it to the file in an output directory. To verify the certificate authority is trusted in the vCenter server, the confirm CA in vCenter commandlet gets the thumbprint from the root certificate and matches it with the CA thumbprint from the vCenter server instance. You need to pass in the complete path for the certificate file. It returns true if the thumbprint matches, otherwise it returns false. The set ESXi lockdown mode commandlet sets the lockdown mode for all ESXi hosts in a given cluster. The get vSAN health summary commandlet gets the vSAN health summary from vCenter server for a cluster. If the status is yellow or red, a warning or error will be raised. The install ESXi certificate commandlet will replace the certificate for an ESXi host or for each ESXi host in a cluster. You must provide the directory containing the certificate files. The certificate names should be in the format fqdn.extension. The workflow will put the ESXi host in maintenance mode with full data migration, which is specific to vSAN nodes, disconnect the ESXi host from vCenter server, replace the certificate, and restart the ESXi host, and exit the maintenance mode once the ESXi host is back online.